Okay, so today I'm going to do a kids charity shop haul. So I've had a couple of requests for this and I also did a blog post about it a couple of months ago. So I thought that I would do a video to just make it a bit more visual and actually show you guys what I've bought in various charity shops along the way. So first of all, why do I like shopping in charity shops? Well, there's the obvious reason that it's amazing to shop and give money to charity in the process. Like in today's age of consumerism where we're just giving, 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 paying, paying, paying. It's nice to shop and do something good in the process and I also like the way you can choose which charity shops you go to and therefore which charities you actually support with your money. Second of all, when you have kids, as everyone knows, you go through so much stuff. Books, clothes, toys, shoes, like all the time. Buying, buying, finishing, finishing. And I just feel like going to charity shops and buying from charity shops is an amazing way to reuse and recycle all of those kids things that we don't need anymore um, and that other people might not need but we might need and it's just a really nice way of reusing and sharing. Third of all, you can find some really, really, really lovely things in charity shops. Maybe because the stuff's a bit older, some of it's got a really nice vintage feel and when it comes to kids stuff in particular, you can get some really, really gorgeous kids toys, like really nice old wooden toys, I've got a lot of those before, lovely books with like a little quaint feel, clothes that are just quite retro, you can find some absolute treasures. And finally, why do I love shopping in charity shops? I guess just because you save quite a lot of money along the way, like I have found some real bargains in there which knew would have cost me so much more and I made some really decent savings, so that's always nice. I'm going to get going and show you the first lot of things that I have got for Jack from Charity Shops. First up, books. So Jack absolutely loves books, as I'm sure your little ones do. Um, they're nothing special, these books. Like Most of them are just soft bag. This is a really gorgeous one about trains, which she absolutely loves. This one's about frogs. He loves it. This one's hardback. And often they have really good deals, like three books for a pound. So I got those three for a quid. Usually otherwise they're about 50p each or something. Definitely recommend going down to your local charity shop for some kids books. So I was talking about toys before and I'm going to show you two of these kind of like vintage toys that I've got for Jack from charity shops that I think are really beautiful. So this kid's baseball bat I found in a charity shop per pound. Um, Sam really loves baseball and I'm thinking that Jack will probably try it out soon too. So I found this and I found the glove that goes with it and the glove was a pound too and I just figured they're just really fun to have and if Jack doesn't even like playing with them then it's like a couple of quid and you know he's tried it out but they're just really cute and also this wooden <laughs> sword so it's quite random but I feel like it will come in handy for like fancy dress or something and at the very least it's quite nice kind of to display um, it's really beautiful wooden kid sword so I really love that so we found some really amazing clothes for Jack in charity shops. Probably some of my favourite are the following. This Ralph Lauren shirt. So this was £3 or £3.50 I think. It was amazing condition and he's just worn it. So many weddings and smart events and I don't know, knew it would retail, I don't know, 30 quid or something. And as I said, it was just a few pounds so really, really loved this. This jumper is one of my favourites, so it's really big. I always get Jack big clothes, but then they end up kind of hanging off him. This is in a charity shop to raise money for elderly people, so it's hand knitted by a lady there. And again, I think it was, I think this was five quid. I just love the colours. I love the detail on the shoulders of the buttons. Um, yeah, I absolutely love this, and Jack's gonna have this for years, I think. Probably my all-time favourite item of clothing I've got for Jack are these Converse. So, I love Converse, but brand new for a kid, I'm just like, nah. Um, but these were, I think, four pounds, and they've lasted him, and I think he's actually growing out of them, which is kind of devastating. They're so cute, I absolutely love them, and yeah, just amazing find. A couple of other random bits, so, um, armbands, like, you always need them, but you never have them, I just saw them, pick them up, they are a pound, they were brand new, so that's really helpful. But probably my best ever buy from a charity shop is this Bugaboo foot muff for the buggy. It's big. So it cost me £30 and new it cost £95. So that's what I mean about savings. And it was in really good condition when I got it, I literally just bunged it in the washing machine and it came out good as new. And yeah. 
it's been so, so helpful. So that was an amazing find. So that's it. Those are all my kind of favourite bits and pieces that I've picked up for Jack along the way from various charity shops. I really recommend that you get down to your local ones. You've got to shop around a bit to find your favourite charity shops and which ones do good things. Some have better books, some have better clothes. Um, but I really recommend it, especially for kids who grow out of things and toys and books and shoes and so, so quickly. It just makes sense to give and to buy and to share and to give charity in the process. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe on the red button somewhere around here. Otherwise, I will see you next time. Bye.